We're in the woods today, just starting out the uh, cooking with sticks uh, episode. I'm going to be starting a fire soon, and one of the most important things in starting a fire is uh, getting the right materials ready for it. So right now I'm cutting some wood shavings that will be used to uh, start the fire. And, and this technique is something that you can use if, uh, even if the wood's wet, sometimes uh, shaving down a, a stick into little tiny pieces will allow you to have material that will ignite even uh, in wet conditions. Okay, we're making a little uh, TP style fire uh, using very small wood uh, to begin with. And in just a minute I'm going to add some larger sticks. Alright, so general rule is to start with the smallest twigs possible towards the center of the fire and then build out with larger sticks. Um, you need it to get pretty hot and pretty well established before you start cooking. Okay, this is the part of the tricky part of getting the fire going. Sometimes it take a, takes a couple tries. But lighten the little wood clippings at the bottom is the way to get it going. I'm just going to let the fire do its own work. Pretty soon you'll have a roaring blaze going. I'm making stuffed peppers and these are I'm just going to go in some hot water just to blanch for a few minutes. Get them nice and soft before they're stuffed. Peppers are pretty well blanched. Pull them out. Have a nice roast that's been marinating in some oil, some Dijon mustard. I'll be very careful with this not to get the plastic plastic doesn't melt. And we're going to let the slow cook on here. With the stuffing, I think. Add a little bit of uh, Cajun mix in there. Down nice and good. What are these guys doing? These are looking pretty good. I'll keep some fresh lemon going on this just to keep it from drying out. Try to get this uh, touched up a little bit. Take a whole lot sometimes to get it just the right flavor. Fill up oh, one second. Now we're getting ready to fill the stuffed peppers. Hopefully, we have enough stuffing for these guys. As soon as they are stuffed, they're going to get wrapped up and tossed onto the fire so they can get nice and toasty. Hopefully, a little caramelization of the pepper will occur in the process as well. A little lemon refresher on there. Olive oil. Sides all nice and covered. Good amount of 
pepper and salt all around the outside. We're going to double wrap this guy too. And right on the fire. Looks like that meat's almost done. I got the deal. Anytime you're cooking in the wild, you got to be real careful with removing things from the fire. But in the hot fire, it's probably as hot as fire, so <laughs> a little bit of care is needed. Tastes good. here to see how we're doing. Bum, 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 bum. Looks good, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look at that. Prepared just before the end of day. We have a nice little meal to celebrate the evening. <laughs>